It's always a great day to live in the 1980s, especially when you're playing Hotline Miami. Turn up the stereo and prepare to raise hell. While many argue over what the best game console is or what future game consoles will bring, Hotline Miami doesn't care. This is the kind of game that's bringing people back to the PC. Downloaded from Steam, Hotline Miami is awesome, debaucherous fun that you don't want to miss. Invest in some good stereo equipment or headphones, too. The music is half the fun. Not for kids, obviously. Hotline Miami is pure violent mayhem in the 80s style. And while it's easy to compare this game to Grand Theft Auto Vice City in particular, it reminds me of an old school PC game I used to play back in like 1990 based on The Punisher. Hotline Miami is more than just style though. The gameplay is really solid and it's very challenging. You can play this with the mouse and keyboard or the Xbox 360 controller, which is what I'm using for Windows. You play through a variety of levels where you just eliminate everybody. It's a great guilty pleasure kind of game. At the end of each level, you're rewarded with this awesome tune, as well as points and some statistics in the letter grade. Way to go, DeLorean driving assassin guy. There's a bizarre plot running through Hotline Miami as well, and it's a harder game than it looks. Replaying levels helps, and you also unlock new masks, which give you slightly different abilities. Uh, I don't care about mowing down the drug dealers, but I feel bad for the dogs. Even retro-style dogs trying to eat you are your friend. As a general rule, the bad guys are complete idiots, and you can lure them out into the hallway to just line them up and mow them down. Hotline Miami rewards you for playing like a complete maniac, although it's actually much harder to play that way. This was sent to the show by my friend on Steam, Craig. Available as a five and a quarter inch floppy disk or a convenient download. That's some nice looking carpet there, check that out. Who needs fancy graphics? When the 1989 style does just fine. Coupled with some amazing music, Hotline Miami is a debaucherous romp through the Scarface video game that was never made in the 1980s. Thanks again to Craig from Crawley in the United Kingdom, and don't forget to pick up the soundtrack, Hotline Miami. Miami. <laughs>